Okay, let's see if we can demonstrate how to do this mod. So, angle is right. We can get in there. clean very light pressure this way adjust my focus <clears throat> and then it's a very simply this is not the best exacto but simply press into the circuit board Oops. Press the circuit board and wiggle it back and forth gently. And then flick it just ever so, slight, so lightly. And then I'm trying to cut off that little nub just by pushing gently straight down. There. So now you can see there's a white in the middle between those two. So now. <clears throat> not using the best tip in the world here so I will struggle a little bit kind of too lazy to replace it so I want a nice clean tip nonetheless get the solder in the right direction I have the temperature at like 580 degrees Fahrenheit so now I'm looking at get a little solder on that Great, Ryan, you just leave it over there. Yeah, the, uh, Thanks. Okay, so now, great, thank you. So now, I am just going to try and get a little solder in that area. And you can see I left a whole bunch there. So now, you know the white wire I'm just going to go here it's a little long for the wire but it's okay so now I want to get the solder to flow a little solder on there and you can see because it's so it's not very hot solder sticks very easily to there. See I've got a good connection to that via now. And that's all because it heats the right temperature. Now the blue one that goes on the pin is a bit more challenging. So what I typically do is Get the wire to hover over the pin. The wire is a bit short in this case, so bend it so it hangs over like that and find the pin. Now grab the wire and push it into place so that it matches the profile of the pin. That matches the pin pretty accurately from angle and bend. Okay, so now let's get a little solder on that blue wire. That might be enough, I can't really see oh yeah well, this thing really wants to just flick up so I'm gonna bend the wire in such a way hopefully that it 
it bends down naturally. Make sure the tip's clean. Maybe that little stalag tied off there. I can tell the bend isn't quite right. Straighten it out so that the bend, there we go. The bend matches the profile really well. Sometimes I do this with tape. I tape it down in place, but I think I'm going to be able to get this. Okay. Right here, so get the milk going. It's okay, I know it I know it got that other pin, but let's get it off. See if we can okay, they're joined, but if I can get the solder. Only one pin by getting close. Nope. Okay, close enough. You can tell that it's dry. You can see it melt right there. And that's dry, roughly. So maybe tweezers this time instead of my fingers. Now I use my finger because I can mash it. I can hold it in place better. Right there. Boom. I don't think there's enough solder here to do the job properly. This is where a sharper soldering tip would come in. See if we can get some on this wire. Why not having both eyes on the microscope is a bit of a challenge videos most of the challenge here. There you go. It's on there really well. Let me push it that way just the hair. And that's a good amount of solder. inspect it. Nothing. 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 There you have it. Nine minutes.